up everyone heading over to my truck and we're about to do some work today hmm. finally sending these because the other post office wouldn't so we'll see take two all right didn't even film it because it's just so unbelievable but the connections on my battery are messed up they've been a little bit but from the crash so the battery's like pushed in and I had to I can't open the, the hood at all. <laughs> so I had to pull off the whole front light and get in there with my arm and switch them around. I don't know why I didn't film it. I was just so over it at the post office. And I got three of the packages out of four sent out. But I am, I just got a, a text from Robbie and I'm just gonna go surf. I need to just chill for a minute. Like this is too heavy, this lifestyle, so. I'm just going for it. I'm just gonna relax it out and just go for a little surf. Grab my GoPro, my surfboard, and just hit the sash with the boy. So that's the claim. D. You can't with that spider. Yep. What's the claim, dude? The claim is hopefully, you know, like maybe waist side. You think it's good out there? I think it's all right. Yesterday was good. That's good. I'm eating my gruel. I got you this bagel, though. I didn't know if you wanted it. Because I didn't yeah. get your text until after. I'll have the bagel later, but yeah. for now, it's gruel. What is that? It's gruel. It's imitation gruel. It's straight gruel. <laughs> no it's like... Do you think that's a nice truck still? It's still a nice truck. This is a hell truck. <laughs> this is made for going off road and through other people. Like, we didn't want to take the whole bumper off, so we just cut a piece. <laughs> showed up. Oh, I cut most of the grass already at this property that I've been working on. Uh, it's the property that this intro came from, the one that B Colt made. Um, cut the whole front and walked into the backyard, cut some of it, and then I realized there's this. Well, this tree right here is totally dead. That's going to be a problem. They kind of have to get rid of that. But, um, saw this in the yard and don't have any saws or anything in my truck except for this axe which is the perfect tool actually but I just gotta chop this up and throw it over in the woods but this is always something Probably four pieces will do it, maybe five. All chopped up and cleaned up. The only good thing about this scenario is everything back there is woods. I just throw it over the fence. If I had to remove all this and get rid of it, it'd be like a hundred bucks extra. Hopefully I can get like some extra money just for cleaning it up. Cause it's not part of just cutting the grass, but we'll see. All right, so I found this black feather. I see it as an omen of good luck. I saw it about three times. It caught my eye, and then I almost just rode it over with the lawnmower, and it kind of just like puffed out at me, and so it picked me up. I don't know if that happens to you guys ever. But uh, I think it's a crow's feather. Uh, I'm not sure what that means. If any of you know what that means, just uh, leave it in the comments below. Hopefully it's a positive thing. If not, I gotta go with it either way. All right, we got done over at the property. 
over at Amsecan, so we're still in Amsecan at the Home Depot. Who doesn't love Home Depot? But, uh, gonna try and get some Poison Ivy Killer. Some kind of Roundup stuff that they hopefully might have that I saw online. And probably do that tomorrow. But, yeah, just keep living the dream, keep pushing. I want to get it now since I'm here and don't want to have to come back if they don't have it at the local hardware store. So we're going in here and get, getting it if they have it for the dream. We got all of these fucking things, bro. This is insane out here. I don't even know what to look at. Holy shit. Poison Ivy. Yeah, this is it right here, boys. You can spray all this on there. All of it. That's the claim. Never knew about it until now. All right, we'll be the judge of how this works, but poison ivy, poison oak, kudzu. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna test this out and make the claim for ourselves if we can actually get rid of poison ivy because I've never known a way other than pulling it out yourself. And that's just, I wouldn't say deadly, it's as close as you can get to being deadly, in my eyes. If you ever got poison ivy, poison oak, or poison sumac, or whatever, real bad, you guys know how fucked it is. But, uh, on to the next claim, I guess. Alright, I don't know if I said anything to you guys. I mean, I talked about these before, the EMR scratch and wins. Um... So that puts you in the database at the EMR on the corporate level, I guess, however it works. Uh, the customer service slash business slash however the fuck it works. Um, either way. Okay, so reminder, I got a text the other day. I think it was Thursday. It's now Monday. It said EMR promotion one day only, all EMR yards. It says the date and then it says number one copper 260 per pound number two copper 250 per pound and then it says must show this text blah 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 and you get all that extra money so like they're texting me promotions too not just the slips so get on that boys all right so i got this claim going where before, when we went to the phone store, they were claiming our plan. It has data on it already included in it. And literally, I have this phone. Hold on a second. So I'm claiming for the, for the dream, I got to get a new phone. Hopefully, maybe I'll get scared out of there by the prices. Because I've never bought an iPhone in my life from anywhere ever, I don't think. I got one for free, two for free, but uh, for Instagram, for Snapchat, for YouTube comments, for emails, for mainly for work too, for taking pictures and sending them, it cuts out like a whole process, and we're going to see if this can go down for the dream, so mainly for work, this is like a... Uh, So much easier for work. It's unbelievable. Also for Craigslist and selling shit, for looking up prices if I see something in a house. It's just so much better to have. It's like having a computer on you at all times and you don't have to worry about hooking in the Wi-Fi. But um, here we go, going in there. I'm not gonna bring the camera, I don't need to. But I'll, I'll be updating you guys and showing you if I got it or not. But if not, I'll just be stuck with the old this which treated me so good for so long I can't complain so for the dream all right 
So the claim is, here it is, iPhone SE, I think. It's like a five. It's 400 bucks. Uh, $20 upgrade fee from this to that. Not much of an upgrade, I wouldn't say. But yeah, I got my feed. I had it on another iPhone, but it wasn't my actual phone. It was just an iPhone. But if you guys want to check out my live daily life instead of like a day or two after I film it, you follow my Instagram. It's just Tucker F Upper. No lines, no spaces, no nothing. Um, pretty easy to find. I probably put it in my video every time at. And my Snapchat's the same, I think, but I don't use that ever. But now I got, I can get my drone, my Snapchat, all my photos on here. I can put my Canon connected to here. I can put my GoPro connected to here. And no matter where I am, I can look at my footage. I can send photos. I can look stuff up value-wise. Pretty much hooked myself up to make more money in the long run. So... You know, sometimes you have to bite the bullet. You know, I'm not really into the corporate bullshit, and you know, it's easier for the government to track, listen, record whatever I'm doing. Doubtful that they're even worried about what I'm doing. But you know, you're part of the mainframe when you have a smartphone. You're plugged into the matrix fully, 100%. Brave new world. So uh, that's the big claim for today. I'm about to go inside. Maybe I'll do some shout outs. I think a few people sent me some shit and I got some really cool comments. So if I don't forget, I will do a few shout outs for the dream. So, and I got all Sammy stuff in here. She said, Oh, just pick up a few things for my dad. I think it's two trash bags. She forgot to mention these five boxes of shit, but going down to Florida and might as well bring her shit down for her because she can go through it throw out what she doesn't want and take what she does want so this is a nice thing to do I claim and yeah moving along to the next claim all right everyone ending it off the video for today uh, some people are saying they don't like when I don't do outros or really do like a little talk before I end the videos, which I didn't really think was a big deal. But I can see why it would be because you like don't know if the video ended or needed a little bit of closure. But yeah, this is it. I'm not filming anything else. I'm about to go to sleep. I got another day of filming tomorrow and the next day and the next day. Going to Florida on Friday. It's Monday so gonna go there for a week come back gonna go there for a week figure it out come back for like a month and a half and then maybe probably move there eventually for at least six months probably to a year to test it out um, but yeah I just want to say just keep pushing you know every day every day there is obstacles and every day there is you know roadblocks in the way but you know don't let that don't let that get you down don't let that stop you from completing what you want and continuing to persevere and continuing to follow your dreams whatever that dream may be um, there's always light at the end of the tunnel and really we only get one chance to prove to ourselves uh, that we really are great and we can accomplish what we really want to accomplish on this planet, on this realm. And don't sit around and wait. Go out there and make it happen today. Because, you know, next week or next month or next year might be too late. So make the changes that you want to see now. And start now. Uh, that's all I can say, really. Just keep living it. So I'll see you guys in the morning. You.